good morning welcome back to another vlog it is wednesday is it wednesday i don't even know my phone is to check gonna be like hair and makeup are done this is my outfit and then i realize <laughs> i need to tidy that up in my defense this was my nephew's um birthday present in and it's not till may but i'm wearing my floral jeans i got from target i think it was target when we were over in la in anaheim for disney and then this is just a h&m jumper i do struggle to style these like unless i just wear like a white t-shirt so i thought we'd throw on this kind of neutral jumper that's just what we're going with today it is quarter past 10 oh i've got a text <laughs> um it's quarter past 10 i need to i don't know why this, why is this towel on here oh no that's so upsetting i have this hung on like the door for under the stairs and the fucking things fell down that's probably not going to stay but whatever it is <laughs> It's about quarter past ten and I obviously need to film these stories to send off for this ad. Um but I am starving. So we're having a bagel. Um we did the food shop yesterday and I don't know, I saw somewhere online um having bagels and cream cheese and I was just like everybody stop that's what I need so yeah I'm gonna do my bagel and then eat that film these stories and then I think I need to leave here about half 11 20 to 10 to go pick my mum up so there we go whilst my what is this bit of hair I don't even know what side that's meant to go on. Whilst my bagel is in the toaster, I just want to say thank you so much. Um, obviously, the last vlog was like my first vlog back. I just want to say thank you because I got some really lovely comments and the support's been amazing. And just the, the support in general about like going freelance, it's such a big thing. And I had a career coaching session yesterday and I'll definitely talk a bit more about that if you're interested. Um, it's my third one of four. And I was just saying to her, like, if I don't think, like, I think if I didn't have these sessions, I would have just gone and remained in my comfort zone and gone straight back into nine to five. But actually what I want is the challenge and the freedom, I guess, to pick and choose the work I do, have more time to create content, jump back into YouTube, manage the Facebook page and kind of chat with the community over there. So yeah, I'm feeling really good. Like I said, I've got my first freelance client next week, so I need to prep some stuff for that this afternoon and pull like together like a statement of work and like just the invoicing kind of schedule. All the things like I never really had to touch in a nine to five before, but it's just nice like learning and doing all these things myself. Um, so yeah, I'm feeling really positive. I've got a couple of meetings booked in for next week. Um, so yeah, I don't know, I just wanna say thanks because it genuinely feels like I've got like the most supportive community over on Instagram, Facebook, here, wherever. And it's just so lovely and I want, I don't want it to go like unknown or like I really do appreciate it. But anyway, I want my bagel now. recorded and sent i don't know why i'm doing that voice it is 20 past 11 so let's go get ourselves ready to go out so i'm having an outfit change because as much as i love those jeans the weather is not representative so instead i've put on some like fake leather trousers i'm not gonna go out on this obviously i've got a jumper to go over the top but I need to clean my teeth. Um, I feel like I clean my teeth three million times when I have Invisalign. But let's go clean our teeth. God, this is so interesting. I don't know why I'm using this horrible angle. Um, but there we go. I need some proper socks because 
I think I'm gonna I'll say proper socks I mean like not trainer socks that's all I live in um, but I think I'm gonna wear my boots today because like I say the weather is shit um where's my jumper gone well, am I all right got it panic over don't worry I should have already left by now I don't want to blame COVID for everything in my life but I was so good at timekeeping before the pandemic and now I run around like a headless chicken quite literally well not literally because obviously I'm not a chicken but let's go if you were my car keys where would you be? I did this last week and I'd left them in Nick's car and he'd gone to work. So I had to find my like emergency key. <laughs> Went over the door, the alarm goes on. Panic over everybody. I know you were all panicked. <laughs> I rang Nick and he'd put them somewhere because I have a tendency just to leave them, like, leave them out. I'm back from my lunch. I had a fish finger sandwich. It was lovely um i also went to the post office and just life admin stuff i do need to go and pick up a parcel um from vinted but i just the weather no <laughs> maybe tomorrow um yeah i'm gonna grab my laptop and work from my sofa i think i think it's about half three um and that's probably me for the next couple of hours very exciting as always <laughs> this is my look for the rest of the day sweet I've got my laptop, I don't want to throw that down. We've changed into some sexy pyjama bottoms. And I'm going to sit on the sofa and do work and emails until Nick comes home. <laughs> need a drink as well. I need to get a drink. I feel like I really need to get the hang of like where to put you around the house. I'm parched. Anyone else? If you know, you know. There is only one drink that I'm going to have right now. And it's Ribena. Growing up, we never really had Ribena. Because I feel like it's like one of the more, sorry that's the fact, one of the more like expensive juices. But if there's one thing me and Nick have taken into adulthood is we get the juice we want and we adore Ribena. We actually get it from Costco and you get like two big ones and it's not like that, that expensive. But isn't it funny the things that like are your almost like not when you like become an adult and like move out i'm like yeah sorry no it's exclusively a ribena household we may sway to vinto from time to time but then we regret it when we go back to ribena um and this is <laughs> this is the content you came to see greenhouse academy it's really bad <laughs> But it's also really good and such an easy watch. They, I don't understand the school. Like, there's a lot of, like, plot holes. Um, but I don't know. I'm enjoying it. And actually, I'm like, I started watching season three, episode one the other day. And they've just randomly recast two of the people and got rid of one. And I'm like, like, they've written one out that actually was one of the best characters. And then two of the main characters, they've just recast. I'm like, Huns, this isn't okay. But anyway, if anyone's looking for something trash... Easy to watch. Greenhouse Academy. Good morning, it is Thursday. Um, what did I last vlog yesterday? I don't know. You'll know, because you've just seen it. Um, but I spent last night, well, all of the afternoon basically, just doing some like freelancey work bits. Um, I did like an uh, audit for an affiliate program. Um, and to be honest, today I probably need to get that all into like some slides and stuff. Although I could do that tomorrow. As you can probably tell, I'm just not really feeling it today. I'm just a bit like meh, whatever. Um, but I'm savouring this like quieter time with like the freelance biz, given that I've only started it this week. So I've got quite a few meetings next week. So I feel like this week I'm just easing myself in. Like we watched Married at First Sight, we watched Rise and Fall, and I want to show you my Lego creation because I'm so proud of myself. Here it is. Although, sorry hon, you shouldn't really be just... Oh, okay. Well, whatever. You don't want to stand up, that's fine. So it has like this extra bit. Um, let me turn it around so you can see like inside the house. It is really cool. Um, 
I just love it. Like, it's got the little seat there. Oh, how fab is it? I haven't got dressed yet, so I'm going to sit and have my breakfast. I've got a bagel and a couple of little petty full yogurts because I'm a child and I love them. Probably going to watch a bit of telly, then get dressed, and then laptop time. Um, although I have been speaking to Nick about Subway for lunch, so I'm looking forward to that. I think we're going to go to Traffic Centre tonight because I need to pick up a parcel. Um, so, yeah. Happy Thursday! Very exciting parcel that's just arrived. It doesn't look it, but it's my new wife at Converse. I've been wearing Converse, like the rest of us, since I was like... I don't even know, like, forever. I definitely even had some when I was little. My mum was telling me the other week, after. Anyway, I have come to the conclusion that I think my feet are too wide for them. And I don't have particularly wide feet, but I've been wearing the same black pair now for years and they're just not super comfortable. And I have, like, worn them to death. So I need to upgrade anyway to a new pair. So we've gone for wide fit, just the black high tops. Um, and I will report back on whether they're any comfier for me. I do struggle with shoes generally, I don't like finding any that are comfy. So we all know Crocs and socks when I'm on holiday. <laughs> My Tiva sandals are also great. Um, New Balance trainers seem to be good for me and a pair of Axel Arigato trainers, but other than that, I'm blisters all over. Who cares, it doesn't matter. But yeah, I'll report back. subway haul i have got hearty italian six inch tuna mayo with cheese toasted red onion pepper and a bit of sweet onion sauce and it's a 10 out of 10 i'm assuming it's a lighter one what did you get nick bmt with a load of stuff on i don't know he's got pepsi max i've got pepsi max cherry obviously you can't have a sandwich without crisps, so I'm going to go and get some. Let's do cheese and onion today, both of us. I like it. But for the meal deal, we went with the rainbow cookies. What a time to be alive. I want to know what... I want to know what your Subway order is. So I'm going to eat this now. I've had got loads of work done this morning. That Subway was everything I needed and more. Um... Yeah, I can't even explain to you how good it was. It was just like, yes. Um, I'm at my desk, as you can tell. This is obviously my office. I'm attempting to do my tax return <laughs> before, like, now, rather than when we hit the like, the deadline in January, because I want to be organised. But I need supplies. <laughs> so this is my little, like, treat drop. To be honest, I don't actually touch this very often. Um, my friend Aston sent me an amazing care package with three Tony's chocolate in, so I try and have that when I'm like really down. <laughs> this is from Vegas. All of this is from Vegas, to be honest. Like when we went away, even these are from the airport. I've got this though, and I bought these from this amazing small biz. Um, I even have an American Santa back there, you know, for you know days when it's just you know you're sad. <laughs> I haven't tried these yet actually, but yeah, so this is my little stash, I've just picked something out of it. But I forgot I had these and I was going to like, make cute Easter hot chocolates. Oh well. But I have picked these out for a little snack. Aero Golden Honeycomb Melts, so that would be nice. And then I was trying to keep track of like, my receipts and expenses <laughs> in this box, but there aren't many receipts in there. Nick is not happy. <laughs> But yeah, I'm going to attempt to collate all my expenses. It's really boring, isn't it? But at least in January, when everyone else is scrambling to do theirs, I will be smug AF. And then I've got myself a much better system for the new tax year. <laughs> so I'm feeling good. This lighting is terrible, but has anybody got one of these Apple mouse mice and got a good... Um, mouse mat suggestion because this is shit i don't know why and then it's even worse on this because it's like glass so please let me know because this is just a really cheap one off amazon that i got ages ago um but it just doesn't it's rubbish Good move on 
think I definitely did not end the vlog yesterday. In fact, we went out to the Trafford Centre and I forgot to take my camera. So you probably got some rubbish iPhone clips of our food. Um, we went to go sushi because that's what Nick really fancied. And we, we only went because I had an order to pick up from Calvin Klein. Oh, God. Um, but today is Friday and we're ending it here. Um, I'm just going to do my hair while I chat to you because I've had a shower this morning but I think I can get an extra day out of my hair um, and probably wash it tonight for tomorrow because we're off to Newcastle. So if you watch this when this goes live on Sunday, we're in Newcastle. How exciting! Um, but yeah, so yesterday afternoon we ended up doing like a load of stuff for my like tax return. Um, because I don't keep track of stuff like a normal person should. Um, it does make it a bit difficult so we've set up like some trackers for like, I guess, expenses and stuff now so this tax year will be a lot more smooth. But I just need to work out some more mileage stuff and then we can submit it. Um, and I save, like, whenever I get any money in from, like, Instagram, and obviously now it'll be freelance stuff, I save, like, a, probably a little bit more than I need to, um, just in case. So when I do do my tax return, that's not hot enough, when I do do my tax return, <clears throat> it means I end up with, like, a bit of money back, which is very useful right now, given that, um, obviously I don't have my, like, full-time income, um, so yeah. I'm gonna sit and edit this vlog today. Um, I need to do some freelance work and then edit this. And I have no idea what it's gonna be like. I don't know if it's gonna be any better than the last one. Um, so yeah, let me know down below if there's anything you want to see. Did not get around to do my gallery wall, did I? And I'm just in my head because I just every time I go to do it, I'm just like, I can't be bothered. <laughs> I know I need to go out and get a couple more frames, and I know I'm gonna need some more command strips. So really, what I need to do is just go out and get the frames and buy the command strips and then I can do it so yeah <laughs> I was looking at my diary for next week and I'm actually like busy with meetings so I don't, I don't even know when I'm going to be able to do it the funny thing is no one cares about this gallery wall as much as I do obviously um but it'd be nice to get it done before next weekend because we're having like family round to celebrate Nick's 30th so yeah it's the one in the dining room Oh well, it's not the end of the world, is it? And like I say, no one cares as much as I do. I'm just dying to get it done because I've had a few like new prints that I need to go on. But anyway, no one cares. Um, <laughs> I hope you're all well. I hope you've enjoyed whatever I've managed to pull together here. Um, I've linked like the Facebook group and Instagram um, down below if you want to follow me over there and join the group if you're not already. Um, yeah. I will likely be back with another one next week. Um, like I say, anything you want to see, just pop it in the comments or any questions, let me know and I will see you next time. See ya!